hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl being peace if this is the first time you're seeing this beautiful face hi welcome thank you for stopping by feel free to stick around give this video a thumbs up like share comment and don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to subscribe to this channel guys let's get us to 200 subscribers a bit Today I want to rant. So I dropped a video a few weeks back. I'll leave the link up here where I mentioned that I had moved from just to Abuja. So I'm going to start in a series called Abuja Living where I'm going to share my experience living in Abuja. And today I want to rant. Hmm. Um, uh, this baby girl like this. They, they duped me in this Abuja. Ah, they duped me in this Abuja. Jesus Christ. Like, you know, when you actually think that you are street, like you're street smart, you know, and none of these things can happen to you. Like, I legit sucked up for days. I was like, oh my, I can't believe that this thing happened to me. So, when I decided to move from just to Abuja, I came to you know check out a couple of apartments that I had seen and I saw this very house and I liked the house I really liked the house I was like okay I was going to go ahead and pay for the apartment I said if you give me landlord's number they gave me like they gave me landlord's number I went to the bank and I made the payment a few days after I made the payment the agent called that Oh, there's something he needs to tell me that it was somebody that had paid for the property already But then she wasn't going to stay so they will use my money to refund her I'm like, okay, I mean I pretty much don't know how that is my business But I guess it was just courtesy of him wanting to tell me or let me know So he now said that oh the landlord said you're not going to count my rent from December They were going to count my rent from November and they'll give me back one month rent and I was like, okay, no problems. He refunded me back one month and I had fixed the dates for when I wanted to move. I moved into the house on the eve of Christmas. I'm sorry, I'm laughing. This every time I remember this story, like it cracks me up. I moved into this house on the eve of Christmas. And by the by the by Christmas day, my landlord came. And he's like, sorry, have we met before? Before then, the night I moved in, my neighbors had told me that I don't look like the lady that came to pay initially. I was like, I didn't quite get it. So when the landlord came, I was like, have we met before and stuff? I'm like, gang, gang. Okay. Because I kept telling the caretaker guy that I wanted to meet the landlord. He was like, don't worry, this is Christmas period, you're going to meet him and all. So I spoke to the landlord, I'm like, oh, God, your new tenant, and he's like, eh, you don't mean it. So it turned out that the supposed caretaker guy had defrauded me. The landlord didn't know about me. The account I paid the money into wasn't even the landlord, it was the caretaker's account. And I did not know because that was the account number the agent gave me. So we now went to the guy's shop. It has a shop not very far from the house. We went to his shop and then my landlord made a series of trouble with you know him. Why would he collect money from his tenants in his name and then he didn't even tell the person and it was just a lot of back and forth. I couldn't sleep in this house. I was so restless. I was like what is what kind of wireless? How did I even get myself into this you know trouble? My landlord gave him two weeks to pay back the money. So it turned out that the other lady that paid for the place initially, the guy had refunded the lady, but then again, still ate like three months inside the lady's rent. You see how human beings can be greedy. So my landlord gave him two weeks to pay up, you know, the three months he ate plus the one month he ate for mine and all of that. And at the end of two weeks, Oga did not pay the money. So my landlord was like, Madam, 
on a normal day i would throw you out and tell you that i don't know you because you didn't pay money to me but i'm not going to do that because i'm a good person i'm a decent human being so i won't do that to you so what i'm going to do is i'm going to allow you to deal with this guy directly however you guys are going to do it do it but i need my money and i had to deal with him directly and that involved me going to the police station that's something i never thought i would do but then i had to go to the police station because um, i needed to get this money now before then my landlord came to lock up my apartment he came to lock up my apartment that you know I, that is going to ginger this guy to pay the money since he has locked up my apartment so i had to go stay over at you know a friend and it was just a lot like i just wonder what's wrong with all these abuja agents like they will stress you <laughs> well i was able to get the police to arrest this guy and then we gave him you know some form to sign on when exactly he was going to pay the money we gave him like a week interval from the day he was arrested and yeah he actually paid the money eventually and the whole thing was sorted out i didn't want to do this video until the whole thing was sorted out just in case the guy did not pay the money and then my landlord decided to come and throw me out again but yeah he eventually paid the money it just turned out he was a greedy fellow and he just wanted to eat the landlord's money and all so my advice to you people if you're moving to any place whether it's abuja here lagos wherever you're moving to and you're going to pay for a house insist that you want to meet the landlord pay the money to the land make sure that that is the owner of the property don't pay money to anybody you don't be like me <laughs> me i did not know make sure you pay money to the land if i insist that you want to see the owner of this house don't even let them they are going to tell you madam don't worry the landlord is always busy so tell them no problem you are going to, you want to see the owner of this property. if not <laughs> see that is how i would have lost like thousands of yeah because see that man had thrown my things out like and i'll probably be sleeping on the bridge in abuja now god forbid <laughs> yeah but that's like my first experience in this abuja like at some point i was like uh -uh, did i even do a mistake by you know moving down here but i'm happy all of that is sorted out so please if you're moving into a new place you see a property that you like make sure that you meet the owner of the property that like, be sure that that is the i know that is how they you know bring people and they'll be like oh this is the owner of the property insist that you want to meet the owner of the property you pay and you collect receipts don't go and be doing oh you come back later for receipts don't do that these agents guys they're very greedy people they are going to scam you of all your life savings and they won't even blink an eye so guys this is, it was pretty much a rant i just wanted to tell you guys my first experience in abuja it's been a month officially since i moved and you know things are pretty much going well um rafia by money had officially started guys we opened a few days back i'm going to leave the link to our instagram handle where you can shop everything rafia remember i talked about this in my previous video i'm going to leave the link somewhere up here where i said i was going to be starting a new business after i settled so it's called rafia by money and had launched that officially a few days ago guys so don't you can see my rafia mat on my wall right isn't it beautiful i know you love it so please i'm going to leave the link to the instagram handle where you can place your order and if you have any questions so far please do well to let me know and secondly, if you have any place here in Abuja you would like me to visit and do a vlog about, please do well to make recommendations and drop it in the comment section. I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. I love you guys. Bye.